looks lower than it was last night, doesn't it? I'm trying to work out whether it was uh, better or worse. I think it was lower yesterday. You lower yesterday, yeah? Well, we'll find out. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Throw this rope at you. And I'm going to push up. Thank you. if we can get up creek hopefully it's not too shallow here we go This is helping a lot actually. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see that, but we can sort of try and follow this out. Yeah, I'll Maybe give you this footage and you can yeah, see it's it. giving us a hint. I'll go a little quicker. Yeah. Now that I'm sort of confident I can see where I'm going maybe. Do you reckon I cut across here? Beautiful. <laughs> Second catch. Two for two. Oh well that was really cool. Uh, not only were the drone shots spectacular, but um, like that really helped us get through that shallow section. We were sort of just flying by uh, instruments there for a second and just hoping that we'd get through and we could even see the patches of rocks and we just got to navigate around a few. So yeah, no, I think that got us in the creek today because so, it was uh, pre pretty shallow. Um, today, what we're doing is we're gonna, we did put some pots in last night, but what we're gonna do uh, a little bit of a cool split of the videos so we don't have we're not overlapping content so Taku's going to do the mud crabbing section and I'm going to do hopefully a whiting or a flathead section if we have some luck so we're going to go up the creek a bit have a little bit of a fish and then uh hopefully we'll get something maybe for a, a brunch and then we'll do the pots and we'll deal with that uh in the second part of the video but um yeah hopefully we've heard stories of giant whiting as well so we'll see how we go oh look at that that float there, that's one of, that's the first pot that we put in. It's hard to resist checking them, but we're going to. You never know, there could be big crabs hopping in there right now, so. Yeah. Yeah, really hard morning. to resist. We might be going in for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. We don't want to disturb that. Like, oh, and there's another one. So we, we just basically peppered this section because we couldn't get into some of the other little creeks because we were, we were a bit late off the mark last night and the tide got so low that we, we barely got, a, got we barely got back to the ramp, to be honest, so yeah. Uh, Taku sort of wanted to, like had an idea that maybe he'd like to catch a flathead. Yeah. That's a very iconic Australian fish, so I was like, well, it should be a very similar kind of ground uh, for the mud crabs and the uh, flatties, so hopefully we can maybe work some of the sandbanks. And there was actually a nice little sort of uh, uh, branch in the creek up here. Maybe we'll start there and we'll work our way back and we'll see how we go. And if we get stuck, We'll ditch it and we'll just uh, walk along the sandbank, I guess, and we'll wait for that tide to come in. It really does sort of... Oh, yeah. It really, and if you're just cruising along, that does look like a little prawn just cruising along. It does. Nice. Oh. Um, yeah, it's a worker bank, I guess. <laughs> I'll slowly, I'll move up there in a sec. We'll see if we can get in there. I think it did get pretty shallow up there, though, didn't it? Yeah, that's 
It'll be fun just to see. So we brought some worms because we we sort of wanted to target some whiting here and there. Just unweighted. See if we can at least see what these guys are. Come on, at least give me some little nibs, yeah, some little nibbles. I want some little nibbles. <laughs> oh, there's a nibble. Here we go. We do get a solid hook up here. They're not going to stand a chance against this setup. <laughs> <It's like> a... <coughs> I can feel them nibbling it. Look, yeah. look, they're going for it. Still yeah. more... oh, come on, one good, one good tug, mate. Just give me one good tug, please. Oh, we got oh, him! Yeah, we, got we got him! Ah, oh, it's a brim, is it? No, what is it? Oh, it's a tiny, tiny little brim. <laughs> Well, another iconic Australian fish there, mate. <laughs> That's just like a little yellowfin brim. Wow. Nothing exciting there. <laughs> well, good to know. Tiny little, well, we got something. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We still got a worm left. <laughs> oh, yeah. Cool. So, How so big do those get? Um, oh, maybe, yeah, like 40 centimetres kind oh, of thing. Yeah, it's yeah. a big one, you know, like you get up there, a yeah. couple of kilos. Cool. But um, this guy's only a little fella. Oh. And he's gone. Yeah. <laughs> you need to go. <laughs> well, that's not as exciting as we were hoping. It's not one of those uh, 30 centimeter whiting, but... <laughs> but, we got a fish. A fish. <laughs> oh, well, we've still got our bait on. We might as well drop it down again. If we keep catching those though, we'll, we'll go somewhere else. <laughs> Oh, fish on. Oh, oh no, came off. You came off? Yeah. No. No. Oh, that, I reckon that would have been a flatty or something. Oh, way, shucks, uh, man. You know, on that bigger prawn or what? Yeah, it's just that, uh, uh, just didn't hook them. The weedless, you know, yeah, just didn't hook them right. Oh, if we get, um, if we get too much of that going on, we can shoot through the troubles. Yeah. Oh, that was good, though. Okay, okay. So nice. Yeah, now, now we've actually got some enthusiasm. Yeah. Sure it's happening. It's, it's happening. happening. <laughs> now, you know what happened? It's when I do this, like when I click the GoPro. Yeah. You know, like... Yeah, you know, yeah, and you just lose this a little tension. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, man. No, catch one of them. I want you to catch one. <laughs> wow. That was a flathead. I'm sure of it. <laughs> no. <laughs> sure. <laughs> you need one of those big flathead. That yeah. you sort of hooked up on a second ago, I reckon. How big do they get in here? Well, I've never fished here before, but <laughs> but oh, you could get yeah, like yeah, you could get like an eighty centimeter. You could get oh, a you could get a meter long one. They get a big like over a meter. Yeah, yeah. But that's a pretty that's a rare catch, you know. <laughs> like yeah, you you know like you've got every chance of getting a good like you know like a sixty centimeter. You know, plus one would be a, a great fish, you know. Pressure makes diamonds. <laughs> I like your. Uh, that's a good attitude. I like. I'm gonna switch. You gonna change? Yeah. No, I switched to uh, and soft plastic. I thought. Uh, thought maybe something different. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's not what we want though. <laughs> Damn. Oh, so excited for a second. What <laughs> we got? Look at this guy. It's like a little, little trevally. No <laughs> oh, bugger. Yeah. Tiny <laughs> I'm look at him grunting away. Well, is that, is that, is that going to grow up? That will grow into a GT. No, yeah, no, that no, little no. guy there. <laughs> you wouldn't think he's going to grow into like a brute of the ocean. Yeah. Right? yeah. Be terrorizing everything in his path. Is that a MT, a mini trevally? Yeah. <laughs> 
the opposite, not so giant Trevally. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, he's a cool looking guy though, look at him. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay, well, that's the first time the cup holder's been used like that. Alright. Very cool little fish. And he's going to grow into an absolute monster. So, we'll let him go. <laughs> See you, bud. <laughs> okay. Maybe we'll jump out and go for a little walk. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe we can walk around, cover a little ground. Put the anchor out there. Super. Set it back to you when we get back. What should we just find it? Oh, what do you got? Oh, the little soldier crabs, yeah. <laughs> cool. Watch, um, yeah, like usually when you come across them, yeah. there'll be like thousands and thousands of them. So if once we walk up here, we'll probably get a whole bunch of them, yeah. Down he goes. <laughs> They're pretty cool, aren't they? Yeah. Pretty cool. Like, oh, look, 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 here they go. Here, look, 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 look. Here they go. <laughs> See, now <laughs> we're talking. <laughs> Because I was like, oh yeah, you wait till you see them. Like yeah. there'll be hundreds of them. <laughs> there they so go. Funny. And then once they, once they realise they can't outrun you, they go, oh, and they all start going down like this thing. Which is going, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so cool. These ones are a little bigger, huh? Yeah. <laughs> little oh, clamber, oh. clambering all over each oh. other. What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> like yeah, there's no reason why they shouldn't be a flathead. But uh, what's that? Is that just a puffer? I haven't seen any any floody kind of movement though. <laughs> These guys are everywhere. There's a turtle just there. Is he is he alive or is he? I'll get my little little tickle on his little fin. I don't think he's alive. I think he might be. No, I think he might be dead. It's kind of all sunny and... Yeah, no, I think he's... I think he's passed away. Oh, that's no good. Maybe not that good. It's a bit ambitious. Yep. Yeah. Hey, there we go. Go. Oh. oh, we got something on the trail. <laughs> Oh, it's a, it's a, a bit of a fight. Not a bad fish. Is that a tailor? You'd you'd call it a bluefish. Oh, okay. Whoa. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, let's get in there. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> let's take yeah. this yes. Woo! Well, it's full of beans, that's for sure. Yeah. Hey, we got there something. There we go. <laughs> wow. It's not a bad tailor, actually. Oh, I'll have to check. Uh, so you guys, uh, what do you, how do you guys rate these guys? I have no idea. Fresh, I've never had, quite nice. Yeah. Never had them. Yeah. No, no. This guy's a this guy's a keeper. Cool. On the troll. Yeah. Well, it's sort of cheating, isn't it? But we'll take it. <laughs> we'll take it. <laughs> take what I can get we'll right now. It. Okay. That's not a bad tailor. I'm quite excited about that. Very unexpected. Beautiful fish. All right, and we've got the ice, bled and iced. That works. All right, no, I'm very happy all of a sudden. <laughs> I'm starting to lose hope. Look at that, he bit a hole straight from my net. Wow. Yeah. No, the tailor, they, that's what they call them, choppers. They're definitely, uh, they're definitely, um, yeah, I did this, made this brag mat at home with just like an old brag mat that I had. 
and I was measuring all, all these flathead on the video recently. Yeah. And but I, for some reason, I didn't realize it didn't start at zero. It had like a bit of extra, like another four centimeters. So all these flathead I was letting go. Oh. Like the very first fish I caught would have been legal, and yeah. it took me like two days to catch a fish. A legal one in the end, and I would have had a legal oh. one straight after that, but I didn't realize because I was because I'm an idiot, <laughs> and uh, I was using a brag mat that started five centimeters shorter. <laughs> okay, it's just another crab. Yeah, that's a very old crab boat. Yeah, it's definitely time to do the clean out in this river system. A lot of lot of old crab pots. Only uh, the officials can, uh, official fisheries people can take them out. Otherwise, you get in trouble. All right, though, we're getting up. This might be about where we start walking, I think. Real shallow. Yeah. Oh, up here. Oh, okay, we got one. Oh, he's slightly bigger. Okay, so the first one, oh, maybe he's not much bigger, but he's uh, <laughs> just got more beans. Jeez, they go hard, don't they? Oh, no, he is bigger. Oh, he's a keeper. Nice. So 23 is the center, the size. But if we get a few like this, we got lunch. Okay. Oh, <laughs> we caught him. So these guys are... These guys are all muscle, aren't they? Yeah, what have I got? Um, you know what we did? That, that crab trap there, maybe we can use one of these ponds. That crab trap just there has like a, maybe I can pop him in a, uh, just a little uh, divot here. Because there was a fair bit of water around some of these ones. I got one just before, but I, my camera wasn't on. I thought it was on, but it wasn't. All right, here we go. Perfect. Now the only problem will be catching him back out of here. <laughs> you chill in here. Where'd he go? He went straight under there. <laughs> he's inside the pot. I'll never get him out again. Anyway, we know he's in there. We'll come back. <laughs> okay, we got some. Oh, I think I got him again. Oh, this is not the target species. <laughs> yeah, another one of these guys. See you later. Oh, damn. We had a good little tug there. Unfortunately, I missed it. Oh, is someone still having a go there? I, oh, I think I got him, but uh, he's not very big. Oh, ah, oh, no, it's a puff. Oh, I think it was a puffer fish. Cheeky bugger. Well, serves him right. Got a little water skiing lesson. Oh, okay, we got we got something this time. Let's see. Ah, is it? Ah, it's another brim. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, no, that was a whiting, but I pretty much just flung him into the next century. <laughs> Big strike. <laughs> Whoops. Let's have another go at that. So those little flecks all through here are whiting. He wasn't very big anyway, so it's all right, but. <laughs> I guess, hopefully we get, we really need like two more whiting at least, don't we? Okay, we got something in there, there we go. What have we got? Uh, another bird. All right, getting over you guys. Started out fun, but he hadn't caught much.
There we go. Oh. Come on. It's not a, it's a bream, is it? Fish on. Yeah, hey, uh, little guy. I think it's another brim. Yeah. <laughs> Spiky little guy. There you go. There we go. Oh, come on. What is it? Oh no, it's another another brim. It fell stronger. Yeah, maybe we need to move, huh? Whoa. We got one? <laughs> okay. He's a uh, he's size, yeah. No, okay. So we got two, <laughs> two sand whiting. Ah, uh, too small. <laughs> too small. Oh, we got another one. We are these big ones. We need some oversized ones to really make it a, a meal here. Are you gonna flick yourself off if you do that? I think maybe. Yep. See you, buddy. So, yeah, this one gets to go back as well. Might need to change spots. Seems like a lot of small whiting. Uh, yeah, he'd be borderline again. I might have to keep a few and just measure him up when we get back. He doesn't seem quite as big. He'd be very borderline. But we'll keep him and we'll measure him up. We'll have to run back and get the measure. He does look size actually, but I'd rather measure him rather than commit to saying he is. Alright. Alright buddy. Alright, look, they're both about the same size. It's not very big for you guys, I'm sorry. Here, let me just make the pond a bit bigger while we wait. We got him. Oh, that one felt like a better one as well. Oh, I was at the end of the bait. That's the last bit. Oh, look at the tiny. If I can catch something on that, that's amazing. Here we go. Let's do it. So you seem to be readily taking whatever to sit on offer, though. So if there's it. A... Oh, <laughs> see that? We are officially out of bait. So what we might do is we'll get that measure and we'll see. Uh, We'll see if we actually made size with any of those, those slightly smaller models because that means we've got three in total which may, may just be enough for a little taster <laughs> but uh, we'll better check the size on those ones okay let's see if we can somehow get this guy out he's under here somewhere Oh, I can feel him. There he is. He's right under there. Ah, oh, I got my sleeve up. Oh, 
You got it, buddy. I'm a coming. Oh, I'll have to let that settle. You got it? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I think it's a flatty. Small. Small guy. Ooh, got one. Got a flatty. Target species. Yep, it's a little one, but. <laughs> Oh, nice. oh, there he goes. You got one. I got yeah. one. My first oh, flatty. Wow, in the canal, huh? That's it. Yeah. I come Just watch out the spikes on yeah. these two sides. Yeah. Did he get you? No, no, no. No. Yeah, I think you don't think he'll make size, but yeah. well, let's measure him just out of interest. Okay. If you can be just so good as to stay right there. Oh. Back a bit, please. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Well, he'd be pretty close, but I think, uh, yeah, I don't think he'll make it. Yeah, what's the size on it? So he's a dusky, he's got a big black spot on the back there. Don't go too far for it. Ready? Yeah. Alright, let's look. Beauty. <laughs> there we go, buddy. Thanks for a little fun. Here he goes. Outskis. Mate, everyone's so slightly bigger. Yeah. Yeah, so that's very possible. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> All right, let's go and try and get this sand whiting out. I had to lift this pot up so I could get to the, uh, get to the whiting. Like, I'm not, obviously, but the problem is it's stirred it all up, so the whiting is in there somewhere. So this is going to be a bit tricky because now I've got to find it. Ah. <laughs> yeah. We knew it would be tricky, but I didn't think it would be this tricky because I thought the pot would be a little bit easier to deal with. Where is the whiting? If I can scare him up to that end, that would be ideal. Well, in any case, if we don't manage to get the whiting, he'll, uh, the t when the tide comes up, he'll be all right. <laughs> Let's see if we can find him, though. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait. Oh my god. It's huge. Wait. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's huge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that, uh, male or female? Smokes. Those are some <laughs> massive claws. Here we go. Yeah, they're big claws. And he's a buck. Yeah. So he's a keeper. Oh, yeah. How do yeah. you feel about donating him to the, uh, yeah. the mud crab? 100%. 100%. Just this a little guy. Feel. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Serious. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright, let me do it. Let me do it. Alright. Good one. Uh, Alright. Nice. You want to just take them back? Yeah, I guess that's probably the easiest. Um, yeah, what I might do. Um, so somewhere in there is my sand whiting. But I guess I guess we're just going to have to leave him. <laughs> yeah. Tide's coming up. I might go. Uh, the tide is coming, tree, coming up. Oh. Yeah, so the branches are underwater now. Okay. That, that, that branch is here at, that was out of the, it was not. Okay, so it is coming in. Yeah, so coming in. should I at least leave the other two whiting? Cause they were borderline anyway. They'll get, like the yeah. tide's coming up anyway. They'll be in the water yeah. in a second. Yeah, that's fine, I think. We okay. have other fish. Right? Yep, yeah. yeah, we got the tailor. Yeah, exactly. No, okay. Maybe it's a baked tailor affair. Yeah. <laughs> well, if we get plenty of crabs in the Oh, 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 shoot. <laughs> Dude, oh my God. is that is oh, that a light? Oh my God, hang on, this is gonna be hard with two. Hey, oh my God. Okay, it's Mud Crab City. Hey, Jesus, is this a male? <laughs> All right, man. All right. Can you see if it's a male? Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 
I guess I'll just go in and grab. Yeah, I think that's a male. Oh, jeez. Okay. Male. Okay. Uh, he's his size. I'll have to measure him. This one's definitely yeah, size. That one is oh my god. Okay. Uh, let's just get him back to the boat and have a think about what's just going on. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the size of this guy. Oh, Took him straight in the esky. I'll get you to open the esky actually, just so yeah. I don't have to put him down because they. This is going to sound silly, but sometimes they like to dig into the uh, the matting and stuff. They start <laughs> biting into it. <laughs> there you go. All right. Well, we got crabs. Let's uh, get this out. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Do you want to? Yeah. If you want to use something to flick them around, don't get bit. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Some pretty serious claws, huh? Alright, well, these guys, what I'll do is, oh, maybe we'll just pop this in there like that. And we'll just leave these guys in there, they'll be chilling and cooling down pretty quick. So, lower their body temperature and that'll just pretty much put them to sleep. And then we can deal with them. Okay, well this, is, this has been a bit of a random turn of events now because now we've got more crabs than we thought we'd have at this point of the video. Um, yeah, so the, the idea was originally I was going to do a fish cook-up and uh, we we're going to save the mud crab for the expert basically and, uh, and then you could go over to Outdoor Chef Life to get that video. But all of a sudden we've got more crabs. Oh, let's go, we'll go check the pots um, and this will pick up on Outdoor Chef Life. And then maybe we'll check back in in a second. I'll be doing a cook up in a second as well. But we'll have to rejig our sort of thought process here. But we'll go check the pots and we'll, uh, one of us, well, we'll both have good cook ups regardless. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> maybe a double mud crab video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We had to think about it and, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to not do a cook up on my uh, on my video because I think we've had a pretty eventful day and uh, we got some good footage and we had a good time and I think we got a decent video and it's going to continue over on Outdoor Chef Life. So we're going to end it here. The pots are just up here. We're going to start pulling pots, but we know we've got enough crabs now for a cook up. So yeah, we're excited. going to hand it over to the master and um, <laughs> yeah, everyone head over to Outdoor Chef Life. His video will be up. If it's not up already, it'll be up in like a couple of hours or yeah. something. So go and check Very out the soon. rest of this one. Cool. <laughs> Cheers. See ya.